breath distortion versus false fold distortion. A wonderful human being asked for this. So, video! Ha! So, what is a false vocal fold distortion or what people call a false chord distortion? So, a false fold distortion is that lovely thing that you hear in Mongolian and Shuvan throat singing. That would be your eh, that. That is a false vocal fold distortion. A breath distortion is what you do when you sigh. So if you literally go, Ugh, and you get that kind of distortion. If you are sighing like a normal human being, add a slight groan to that, Ugh, and you're doing a breath distortion. Anatomically, what we're interested in is the false fold distortion is me actively activating my false vocal folds through the nice ventricularis muscle in my false vocal folds and bringing them together to make solid contact and vibrate. And the breath distortion is me overblowing loads of air and just hoping that something will flap in the wind. Yay! When do you hear a false vocal fold distortion? You hear a false vocal fold distortion in Mongolian and Shuvan throat singing. When do you hear a breath distortion? You hear a breath distortion in pop and rock ballads. Stereotype of this would be ballads sung by Brian Adams. That is a very light breath distortion. So whenever you hear that kind of thing, and they sing like that, that's a breath distortion. And it can get stronger and stronger and stronger until you kind of reach something that is reminiscent of death metal, but doesn't necessarily sound like death metal. What are the metalheads doing? The metalheads are usually doing a combination of these two distortions. When you hear things like etc. That's two things going on at the same time. Ventricularis muscle is active, false folds, false folds, I can't speak, have been brought together and are vibrating, and there's also more breath than you'd need. To be completely honest, this has probably happened because the guys in metal had no technique and didn't know what they were doing, and so they overblew and magically got false fold activation. So your proper false fold sound is the Mongolian throat singing. If you cannot do that sound, uh, you might not have a good control of your false vocal folds. Ding! Within metal, uh, a good thing that you can do is check out Opeth live, specifically. Don't listen to the albums, too much going on. Um, but check out Opeth live when he does growls, and then check him out in Bloodbath. There's very audibly more false fold activation going on with Bloodbath. So Opeth is gravitating closer to a breath distortion. Bleak is a fantastic example as a song. Check out Bleak by Opeth. Most of that is just him going Ooh, with loads of air. Here's a breath distortion for you. We'll start clean. If I add my false vocal folds to that, so I'm going to start clean, go into a breath distortion, and then add false fold vibration on purpose. It changes the tone. So the question is what creates the distortion in the breath distortion? Probably the false vocal folds flapping in the wind. Probably. Not necessarily. Um, I can tell you from doing it and other people doing the distortion and general feedback that you cannot feel your false folds touching at all. It feels exactly like clean singing, but you're leaking loads of air. Um, I also have I also have a personal stroboscopy of me doing a breath distortion and you cannot see any false fold activation, but if the activation was extremely light, 
and very fluttery. We need high-speed high chromatography and high-speed imaging, so that doesn't exclude, obviously, stroboscopy is not <laughs> the scientific method you want to be using in order to determine this. Maher. However, very, very, very little false fold activation, close to none. Let's put it that way. The most common mistake that people make in metal is they tend to do a breath distortion rather than learning how to do a false fold distortion and they just kind of hope that their false folds will flap in the wind. What to do if you are getting a breath distortion and not getting enough false fold? First of all, check out my false fold tutorials and go through those steps and see if any of those steps and suggestions work for you. Um, but other than that, your general rule of thumb is start your breath distortion and then pull back the air. Use less air, significantly less air. So what you're trying to do is this. It doesn't matter if you change pitch. Let everything happen as you pull back the air. It is very likely that you'll drop in pitch largely because we have a, ten a natural tendency when we sing clean to blast and use more air as we go up in pitch even though there's no reason to do this. If you are doing a nice Mongolian tone uh, but you really really wanted to go from uh, all the way to your nice this kind of tone what you're looking for is just a slight leak with the vocal folds, slightly dopey, a little bit of air passing through. This is not an increase in the amount of breath. You don't use more breath. You just, you're here, you're speaking normally, you're going blah 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 and then you leak and you go blah 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 blah. You don't go blah 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 blah, push 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 blah blah blah. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. That's how you'll end up hoarse at the end of your rehearsal or at the end of the show, or even completely voiceless. Don't push air. Ever. <laughs> Technically. Bad. Not good. No. Um, the false fold tutorials that are coming up are going to be addressing getting to that metal tone, so check those out as they come out. But other than that, ta -da! That is the whole idea. So if you're too breathy, pull back the air. If you are not getting that metal tone and you are stuck on a Mongolian tone, leak air from your vocal folds. You practice this clean, not distorted first. Make sure that you are leaking successfully. So that is everything for now. Um, any questions or anything that was not clear, write a comment. I will get back to you. <laughs> this is Selena, a bunch of people were asking where she is. She's right here, I have the best view. <laughs> like, IQ significantly drops. <laughs> Selena! Look! Look at her! <gasps> this is microphone Selena. <laughs>